Hello guys. Today we are going to learn C++ program execution cycle. Uh, meanwhile, you will keep on listening the drum beating behind me because the uh, ritual is uh, going on behind me. So it's quite unavoidable. Okay, let's move toward our work. The first process in the program execution cycle is editor editor is uh, IDE or whatever you write things on uh, like IDE Visual Studio I'm using the Visual Studio like you can see and you can watch my previous tutorial on the same Visual Studio okay it's the editor and the second step is uh, our preprocessor Preprocessor are the directive which give instructions to the compiler to preprocess the information before actual compilation. Um, preprocessor always starts with the uh, hash. Uh, there are a number of famous uh, preprocessors like hash include, which we add with every program you can see in my previous tutorials. Hash include, hash define, which is used in multi filing, hash if. Uh, also multi-filing, else hash if and hash line and etc. Uh, the third point is compiler, which is it is used to find the uh, syntax errors. Uh, it's just used to actually find the syntax mistakes or errors, whatever. Works. And the fourth one is our point is linker. Uh, in computing, a uh, linker or link editor is a computer program that takes one or more object files generated by a compiler and combines them into a single executable fi library file or another object file however uh, well, the next one is loader a simple version that writes its output directly to memory it's called loader a load program it actually load programs into random access memory mean RAM and the last process of execution cycle is obviously execution which shows up the program like if we run the program for example it's a class program simple simple program it's a class we are setting data here we are showing data here in the class is the function for showing the data is the function for setting the data and here we are making objects of class small objects and if we are passing values to the functions here and uh, after passing values we are showing the data through a function show data and it will show values like if we run the it will execute and here the program is executed and you can see the values 1066 and 2100 which we passed here in the main program so I think I think so you like I think so you like material is it it if you like the material do subscribe my channel and uh, you can also download my apps link of both apps programming for c++ quiz app and java quiz app link of both apps would be in the comment sec comment section uh, and thanks for watching like always peace